classification of computers learning about the classification of computers hello friends there are different types of computers having varied features based on their size and performance computers can be classified into the following types microcomputers 2 mini computers 3 mainframe computers and 4 supercomputers first one is microcomputer a microcomputer is a computer in which the cpu is a microprocessor microcomputers are cheap and easy to use they are designed to be used by one person at a time so they are also known as single user computer they are mainly used in offices and homes all personal computers that is pcs laptops notebooks and personal digital assistants that is pdas are examples of microcomputers notebooks or laptop computers have become very popular in recent times a laptop is a light small size computer with the power of pc it can run on a rechargeable battery you can carry it anywhere you go traveling executives find it very convenient to carry all their work in notebooks the personal digital assistant that is pda is a handheld pc it can fit into your palm you can work on it by touching a button or by writing directly on the screen with a stick when a computer is used to run another machine or appliance it is known as the embedded computer nowadays computers are found in almost all gadgets like washing machines watches television and even cars mini computers mini computers are more powerful than microcomputers they are multi user systems it means that many people can use one machine at the same time the storage capacity of mini computers is larger than microcomputers for example pgp 11 and wax 7500 mainframe computers mainframe computers are very large and powerful computers hundreds of people can use them at the same time they work at great speed and can handle a lot of data examples of mainframe computers are wax 8842 and cdc 6600 supercomputers supercomputers are the most powerful of all the computers they are also the most expensive computers they have several processors which make them very powerful and fast supercomputers are used in areas like weather forecasting nuclear science seismology etc a few well known supercomputers are crav xmp crav2 and crav3 param is a supercomputer which has been designed in india summary we have learned the different types of computers having varied features based on their size and performance it was very interesting to learn about different computers keep learning and good going